Hello Nima Fables friends. Today, I've got an exciting story for you. The story title is The Secret of Work. Once upon a time there lived a king in southern India named Sri Ranacharya. He was very curious to know about his village. One day he called out a group of courtiers and said, Go, and find how the people of my village are and bring the person who knows about the secret of work. But one condition, any person you meet, he should not know that I sent you. The courtiers didn't understand the king and they walked away. The courtiers thought about what to do the whole night, each of them got a plan and they said to each other. But all the members liked the plan of Ragu, a clever person among the other courtiers, and they all agreed to it. The very next day they all dressed as tribals and they arranged a bullet cart with them and they went around. First they saw a woodcutter who was cutting down trees they went to him and said, Do you like this job sir? The woodcutter replied, No, I do it because this work comes from our ancestors so I was forced by my parents to do this job. The courtiers said goodbye to the woodcutter and walked away. While traveling further, the courtiers saw an angry washerman and they decided to talk to him. One of them asked, Hello sir. We come from East India and we are new to this place, we've come to visit our friend Ram who lives here somewhere nearby could you please tell his address. The washerman said, are you mad? Can't you see what I am doing? I am doing an idiotic job. The courtiers asked him, sir, do you like this job? The washerman continued angrily, no, when I was small I did not show much interest in studies and I never listened to my parents so, I became a washerman, as I should look after my family and earn a living. To feed them I do this job. The courtiers apologized for disturbing and went away. Then they made up their minds to leave the job and send a message to the king that no one in the village knows about the secret of work. But suddenly, they saw a small hut with five candles and three lamps and a man studying a science book and one of them said that it is a school. They went inside and asked the lecturer the same question. The lecturer replied, I love this job and it gives me satisfaction and happiness teaching so many uneducated children. Hearing this the courtiers took the lecturer to the king and the king appreciated him for knowing the secret of work and soon he became the best teacher in the village and was given an award and soon a big school was built. Moral, any work you do it does not matter, but you have to have some interest in that. If you want to achieve greater heights, believe in yourself. And then you can know that. Work is worship. Thanks for being part of the Nima Fables journey. If you enjoyed the story, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe for more magical tales.